What's up, world? It's your boy Iconic back again with another video. Today, we're not doing an unboxing at all. We're gonna get straight into it. Just got a new shoe, and my boy Zay ordered it for one of his friends. I think it'd be good for the channel. I think y'all would love it. So, I'm gonna get right into it. Off rip, you see the Nike box. Got a little banger inside of here, so we're gonna see it at the same time. What's that? Same time, bro. I don't know you, man. Same time. I don't know you. I haven't seen them yet at all, so I'm going to open it up. Car done fell out, and boom, we have the what is that? Nike rookies, bro. rookies, rookies. Okay, Galaxy rookies. Bunch pretty. Oh, hold on, they ain't mine, so I got to be delicate. I told y'all, gotta be delicate. <laughs> gotta be delicate. So you break, you buy. off rip, we're gonna go ahead and give you this, so you can see the actual. Size tag, it's a size 10. This is how it should look when you get it from anybody. Uh, the exact colorway on this shoe is black, black, action, red, nor, uh, rogue action, and nor. So, um, yeah, man. So, here's this, here's the box. Um, this is from StockX, shout out to StockX, you know. Pretty decent. Here's the StockX card. Well, this is the actual StockX receipt right here. Here's a little StockX card. You know all that, all that jazz that come with it, all that stuff right there. So here's the box. Regular paper. So off rip, man. What is this? Carbon fiber or is it? No, I don't feel like carbon fiber. It feels. Like, yeah, I kind of feel kind of like kind of um. Like plastic. I know the well, the original ones are like carbon, wasn't it? Yeah, and it was it was a little different details to them too. Yeah, so the light thing wasn't in the back either. Oh, for real? Okay. So the tag was up front, I believe. Up front? Oh, hanging down? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. So first, let's get straight into it. Pretty decent shoe. I think it's pretty dope. Like I said, this is uh from StockX. Here's that a little hang tag. If you didn't know. Bro picked them up for somebody, I don't know who it was, but you know, it looks like a pretty decent shoe. Um, the material is on it, man. Like I, I thought all the previous, uh, what is it, flight, flight posits? Yeah. Flight posits had like a carbon fiber, like uh, like the foam. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? But this material is kind of like plastic almost. I don't know what, what to call it specifically, but this ain't the carbon fiber that you got in the, um, like on the foam posits. The rookies? Oh, I'm not gonna call them flight pilot. You can tell I ain't really into it too much. So this, the Nike Air Rookie. And, uh, these are pretty dope though. Um, as far as anything, like, I think that Galaxy whole vibe is kind of played out. Oh yeah, that was 2010, nah? I think 2010 or nine. What? But I think, crazy. I think, yeah, I think it had its, I think it had its, had its uh, run. I think it had its run. I don't think it's, it's all right. There's nothing I would go crazy for, but they are going for about 300 bucks right now, which is crazy. Um, but anyway, straight into it. As far as materials, like I said, this is not really no carbon fiber or anything like that. Like it's more plasticky. You do have like this carbon fiber plate on the side right here. And that's still kind of, this, yeah, that that feels like real carbon fiber on the side there. Yeah, so, oh, dude, I didn't know that. So you're telling me the bottom of it actually glow in the dark. Um, what else? This up, this material right here, it's like a trash new buck. Yeah, man. So you know, I gave one on the Z, but this is um right here. It's not really nothing too crazy. This ain't no like. It's like new buck. It's not suede at all. Um, what else? What else? What else? Uh, like you got carbon fiber at the bottom here. You can hear it somewhat, not too much. But yeah, man. Yeah, man, it's, it's, a, it's a decent shoe, don't get me wrong. I just think the whole Galaxy theme is just, you know, it, it, it ran its course, you feel what I'm saying? But it's pretty dope, like I said, man. You got the, oh, Zay went and did it. So as you can see, it does glow in the dark, which is decent. Yeah, that's fine. So if you look at this one, this is the one that's glowing. This is the one that's not. This one glowing, we put them together. This one's glowing a little bit harder than normal. Yeah, there you go. So that's glowing in the dark right there. This one's doing it a little bit, but not as much as this one, because he went outside with it, and after the, I guess after the sun hit, after the light hit, the light hit it, it, uh, it glows in the dark. So it's, that's pretty decent about it, you know what I mean? I think that's a cool feature. But um, yeah, man, I think it definitely, I think it's a dope shoe. Um, but overall, you know, it's, it's all right. It ain't nothing to, 
ain't nothing to go crazy over for me personally, but used to be though, like in, like what you said, 2011, 12? I say 2009, 2010. Nah, it was way longer than that, bro. It was like 2000, like, uh, it had to be like right after uh, Concords and stuff like that. Yeah, Google it real quick, cause I, I think this was like 2000. Had to be like 2012. Oh, we got, oh, okay, 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 okay. Got some love features on here. I'ma keep going. Yeah, op uh, open that blonde back up for me, please. Get some of that light. There you go. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. There we, there we go. Okay, okay. All right, got blown out for a second, but yeah, it's pretty decent though. Like as far as anything. So we're gonna get right into the actual details though. So. You got this like plastic upper. It's not carbon fiber at all. We're not going to call it carbon fiber. Um, right here, you got the suede. You do have carbon fiber on the inside and on the outside of the shoe itself. Um, man, it's pretty decent. You have this dope, dope, dope. Um, what, what would you call this? Like a hang tag? And it has like, it says remove before taking flight. So that's pretty decent. Let me see if I can make it focus. So that's pretty decent. It says remove before taking flight. I thought that was a dope uh, touch to the actual. Uh, to the Galaxy pack because it came with the um, with these, the Galaxy phones, um, the rookies and the Co Kobe's, Kobe's and what? Flights. The flight, po the flight pilot. Yeah, well they 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 pretty decent. Like I said, this was back in like I think 2011. He about to get the actual date, but you know, 2012. 2012. Okay, so back in 2012, it came in a pack with these by itself. You know, they just re-released these this year. All Star Weekend. Yeah. All Star Weekend. All Star Weekend. They released these. Big Bangs came out in this series, but this is like in 2012. But now they just released these by themselves. But yeah, man. Phones. It looked like the original, but it was some... Oh, that was last year, though. Oh, that was, that was last, last year. year. Uh, last year or the year before. Yeah, sure, sure. But yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Um, they're um, just regular laces, nothing crazy about it. They didn't come with any extra laces at all. Um, I did just notice, though, that it does have a removable patch. That's pretty decent. Yeah. Oh, dope. And they got the penny sign right on the hip, boy. So, you know, if you know, you know. Let's see, let's see. It's gonna focus, it's gonna focus. Focus, there you go, boom. So, right here, just to kind of show y'all, one of them has a patch, one of them doesn't, and this one has that Penny emblem, Penny logo. If you know Anthony Hardaway, Penny Hardaway, you already know. One of the GOATs, he's actually um, beside Michael Jordan. That's my second favorite player of all time for me. But yeah, man, that's that's dope. I ain't gonna lie, he's kind of far. I did say they was all right, they kind of far, they kind of dope. <laughs> Even though I feel like they had a run, I think it's still a dope shooter. As, as far as all the details that come with it for the price, pretty decent. But um, I do wish this was probably carbon fiber though, but I think, um, or just like a, some type of harder plate. Bottom, but I'm saying, I thought, I thought like it was more like a plate. So, you see it? Yeah, I see, yeah, I seen the carbon, I had to tell them a carbon fiber on that. Um, we got some pods on it, nothing special. Um, I know the old ones didn't have a rookie, they had the penny logo at the bottom. Yeah, I, think the, I think the old ones had the penny logo right here in the center, this one doesn't have it. So it's a lot of uh, differences. Um, and this one, then the other one, I definitely have like the photos up during this during this video showing the kind of differences. Um, yeah, man, I think it's pretty dope. Like I said, it didn't come with anything crazy. No laces. Um, I'm just taking this insert out. This is how the shoe uh, insert looks. Boy, what's the difference? Oh yeah, a little more vibrant. It looked more vibrant than that one. Then the tab was in the front. The tab was in the front. Yeah, I wonder. But anyway, this comes with uh, this is the shoe tree right here. I think personally, um, Nike check was. Oh okay, and a, and a ch Nike check. So this Nike check right here that's on the shoe, it was open. It wasn't a full sewn in Nike check, which I think you know that's subtle touch. I think that's not a bad thing. I think that'll work. I don't think it's that many differences. It's like little they subtle. They have to make it a little different though. So little uh, different, little different. Oh yeah, and then the other thing too. Um, here's how the insole looks. So this is pretty dope too. Like I said, man, if you know, you know, man. It ain't always about the Jordans. It's about the uh, you know, Penny, Penny Hardaway. What wasn't black? Oh, okay. That's another thing too. So this is the actual insole right here. So this is the thing you should be looking for when you um, trying to authenticate your pairs to make sure that your pair is real. Um, nothing in the inside after the insole is out. Um, the UPC on this one is zero zero one nine two five zero zero 
292-433. Um, let's see. And what else we look at when we verify again? Um, it's the color code, right? Color code. Color code on it is suit uh suit. <laughs> C12120-001. Same on the actual box itself. So this is the first time me kind of going into those extra details about how to legit check. Um, usually if I get a, get anything off of StockX, even though you know I'm comfortable with buying off of StockX, I still always check the sneaker that come in. Like I always triple check it, legit check it. Just because they have people to check it, you know, you know, if you're not into sneakers, always just have somebody double check it. These look legit, it's they're too legit to quit, so I'm not worried about anything with these. But um, yeah, man, this is decent, man. Everything looks nice on this shoe. I think it's dope. Um, would I buy it for $300? Nah, I wouldn't spend the money. I feel like there's way more dope stuff out there. Um, but I do think it's a decent shoe. One more look at that, man. Let's see, so side view. Let's see, see, boom, boom, boom. So that's dope, man. That's a dope shoe, though. I just thought it would be something nice, something different than the SBs I've been showing on the channel lately. Something different for everybody. I'm gonna get, um, trying to get some off whites in here. I ain't gonna tell you which ones, but I'm definitely gonna be reviewing that soon and a couple more Jordans when the time comes. But retail on these is 220. That's fine. That's phone. That's phone prices, bro. Everything went on, bro. I guess. I guess. But it ain't, like I said, it's a dope shoe. It's 220. So I guess resale like almost 300, which is decent. $80 over, oh, that ain't really nothing crazy. But you gotta buy what you like, you feel me? Like Zay said, you know, if you're gonna buy, you know, I wouldn't, you're not gonna find these anywhere. So if you out in the streets with these on, nobody's gonna have these. So that's the good thing about everything. So like I said, it's a, it's a pretty decent shoe though. I like it. I like everything. On the back heel too, it says that same thing. Show y'all, if it shows you, if it focuses, focus, focus, focus. There you go. So it kind of say that same thing the tag say, which is um, remove for flight. Um, that's dope. Um, oh, big thing that Zay was just showing me on the phone was that um, these pots, these pots were a different color on the originals. I'm gonna post a picture of that. I'm gonna have a picture on the video of that. Um, the Nike check, that was an open Nike uh, swoosh. Now it's more stitched and filled. Um, like I said, it's a new buck right here. On the inner lining right here, it's like some type of netting, which is pretty decent. I was looking at this one. Okay. And sock liner, same kind of netting. Kind of feel like that Jordan 10, uh, or um, what is that? Oh, like regular foams, how they have a, the, how the sock liner is on foams, that's how I feel on this too. But yeah, man, that's a dope shoe, bro. I wouldn't add it to the collection, but I think it's good to look at. And if I did have it in the collection, I probably won't wear it. So probably be up in the case or something. This look good. This is this is a like uh this like a collecting piece, you know what I mean? Like something you have in a case. I don't think I can wear this on foot and it look good. But you never know. I guess it, you know, I haven't seen any on feet, so. And this is what I have on feet today. I think I'm gonna start doing that every time I do a review. Start showing y'all what I have on feet today. And I have those pine green ones on right now, man. This is definitely a banger. I only wore it about three times, so you know it's still looking real good. No creases on the toe box. I want those creases though. I'm, on, I'm trying to wear the hell out of all my ones right now. They look better when they creased up. But you know, you know, some people out there, you know, ah, creases in my shoes. Nah, not me. I, shit, they shoes. They're meant to be worn. Now you know my other shoes. Some shoes I'm like ah. I try not to get no creases in, but them ones, they gotta get all of it, you know? Well, yeah, man, overall, again, wanna shout y'all out and say thank you for watching the video. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I'm gonna leave y'all with a Malcolm X quote. The future belongs to those who prepare today. I'm out of here.